hi guys welcome back to the channel so in today's tutorial is a requested video on how i made a yellow bag that i've shown in my previous video where i was showing how to attach a magnetic bag so if you haven't seen that video kindly go and watch it as well because it's going to be part of this video as well so to begin with you're just going to begin with your beads everything will be linked on the description box below so we normally begin our pattern with four beads then we use the last one to cross it over then we continue with the same rings i normally call it flower with the same flowers until our bag is complete so since we are done with our first flower we're gonna do our second flower so what i'm doing here i'm taking two beads and put it on my left right thread then i cross with the last bead on the left if that makes sense i'm sorry so if you are new here you are highly welcome my name is nolo and if you haven't if you have if you are a re returning subscriber thank you so much and the giveaway was very successful as i've announced that i'm i have i'm giving away the first bag that i did so i'm really happy to give out to the people that have been supporting me and if you, you were not a winner please do not worry we're still going to have more giveaways in future so yeah so stick with me if you are my return subscriber thank you so much and if you are new here here we make a very beautiful diys we touch on vlog lifestyle vlogs here and there and also we do some hair diys hair tutorials if if i could say it that way but back to the back, what I'm doing here, I'm trying to make a turn, okay? So when you make a turn, you're just going to choose any side of your thread. Then you put all the three beads on the side. Then you just pull until it's firm and nicely. You're just going to see that your direction of the beads has changed, okay? So if you were going straight now, it's kind of like you're making a new turn. And also to to turn also to the opposite direction we're still gonna repeat the same thing by adding three beads on the on the very same thread on the sides so that it could turn okay so if you really do not understand the process there is a whole playlist of beading how to make a beads to make any beaded pattern anything i will link it above so that you could see it as well kindly go and check if you are a beginner there is a very friendly beginner tutorials over there as well so i hope you go and like also my videos kindly like guys my videos you know people watch but they don't like <laughs> but anyway that's not the big deal i still thank you for watching
what i'm basically doing here i'm just using one bead to attach the back and the handle okay then from here i'm going to make the cover of the bag and also attach the magnetic bag then yeah guys that will be that will be it for this tutorial and also if you don't know how to attach the magnetic bag i also did a video on how to do that as i said also kindly go and check all the playlists of the beading that i've done you know they are quite self-explanatory and they are beginner friendly as well so yeah after finishing this we are now making the top then yeah we are done so this is how it look without the closing part and you can also rock it this way maybe in case your beads finish and you can also rock it this way it quite look beautiful but as for me i decided to go and make the top okay the top part of the bag so this is where i begin okay i counted three beads from both left and right then i begin from there until i'm satisfied with my top part then yeah you attach your magnetic button with your glue or if you get the magnetic that got the holes for thread you are also welcome to use a thread it's it's not always the clue that you're gonna use okay okay so now we have came to the end of our, of our video so what i'm basically doing here i'm putting my last pattern of flowers then i go ahead and attach the magnetic button <laughs> i don't know how many times i've said that but either way i'll keep on repeating because it's very important okay then i just turn it over to see if i'm happy with the length of it okay then yeah guys i see you on my next video if you have watched up to your so far thank you so much for watching see you on my next video kindly recommend oh yeah kindly recommend any bags that you would like for me to try i'm also thinking of the crochet bags but i'm not quite uh, confident with it yet but yeah i'll get it there you know i have to practice because my mom used to crochet a lot so i'm still taking tutorials from my mom so yeah this is the final guys See you on my next video. Bye.